Hello, it's How To Not To and in today's video I will be unboxing my new Xbox controller for Windows PC. It comes with a USB cable lead to connect from the Xbox controller to your laptop or PC. So let's get out of the box and here it is. It costs around £40 and with that you get the head, the tail, the whole damn thing. And it features left and right joystick, a D-pad, view buttons and a menu button. These buttons, the A, B, X, Y, are used to interact with the games, apps and the Xbox One interface. So what else do we have? Hiding in here you have the 9 inch USB cable wire. That end connects to the controller and the other end connects to your PC. Okay, I'm now going to remove it from the packaging. So here you would connect a wireless adapter and on the back you have the right and left bumper buttons. They're often used to jump between sections of the user interface but um, can perform different actions depending on the game. Yeah, they feel very flexible. You also have your left and right trigger buttons as well and the control feels, well, the control feels really light and it's easy to control as the buttons are positioned close together. So yeah. This is the battery cover. It takes two AA batteries if you are using it wirelessly. And underneath here is the instruction manual and it just shows you how to connect it to your laptop. Pretty straightforward really. It's compatible with Windows 10 and I'll sh be showing you how to connect it wirelessly as well. So first of all press the small button which is the wireless enrollment button at the top edge of the controller for three seconds and then you press this button here and this will start to blink. So while it's flashing click down here on the Windows uh, start button and click on settings, devices, Bluetooth devices and just make sure it's on. Click on add a Bluetooth device and select Xbox controllers. But if you want to use your controller wirelessly, you will need to purchase the wireless adapter. Okay, I'm now going to test it out on a couple of games. But before I do that, please like and subscribe to my channel. And I will now leave you with Layla. Please go and check out her channel and thanks for watching hey guys get your cable and you're going to be putting it inside here okay so once you've plugged it in what will happen is it will vibrate so that you know it's working and the light will be on to know it's connected so then you need to click here and it will start so then i can click new game Okay, so unfortunately we found that this game does not work with the Xbox controller. There is no movement when I do any of the buttons. Only when I use the keyboard does it move. Therefore, it does not work. I've just changed Steam to big picture mode so I can go and see the library of games so that we can actually check which ones work with and which ones don't work with the controller. So when you enter the big screen mode, firstly what you'll need to do is you need to go to settings and you need to go to controller settings. You need to configure your um, Xbox controller and it will recognize it here so they've got Xbox One controller. So you can just click identify that just to make sure there's no problems when you're um, in the game. So I've clicked identify and your controller will shake vibrate so that means it recognizes it you need to configure it to a xbox controller so that it knows that you're using that controller because obviously a playstation controller would be different um controls so then after you've done that you can go to your library so on top you're going to see that here the euro truck simulator on top of the tick has a keyboard um, so that means the game mostly won't really work with a controller. However, when we go to the short hike, it says that it's compatible with the controller. Therefore, it will work when we're playing. This game is called A Short Hike. 
The aim of this game is to collect all the feathers and get to the top because what's happened is you can't get signal unless you're at the top of the mountain and you're trying to contact your mum. In this game you need to get all the feathers, well enough feathers to get up to the top of the mountain. So now you can talk to the characters by clicking A on the controller. So see we want to borrow the shovel but he won't give us one. Well I think we'll just see him later. Oh, I'm stuck. Help. <laughs> so he wants us to find 15 shells. Better get collecting those shells. Oh, so now we have a compass so we know what way to go. You need to click Y to open your adventure, then select it from the item menu. So here I can just pick up another one. And this guy says, oh, can you climb the climbing frame? So you need to learn how to rock climb. <laughs> Hello guys, today we're going to be playing Skyrim on the Xbox One Windows controller. Okay, let's follow these guys. Oh, look at this horse. It's really cool. Oh my god, steel. Yes. Let's go. Oh my god, yes. We're going. This is so cool. Oh my, oh my god, what the hell? I'd rather die than go to prison. Let's run, horse, go. The thing is I can't look behind me now. Okay, we have to keep running guys because our health is gonna go. This is quite a bad situation. So let's see where we can go. I think we're safe. Our health bar's not going down. Oh my God, there's a dead man. That's really worrying. What the hell's that? Oh my God, it's an ugly rat. Like this. <laughs> oh my god, this is not okay. They come attack us. Oh shoot. These people are very hostile because I stole a horse. Like, you know, you can just get another horse. It's not really that big of a deal. But I guess because I don't have enough resources, they're being very hostile to me. So let's keep going. Because I am stealing this horse. So let's go girls. <laughs> that does not sound good, guys. Oh my god, okay, it's okay. That sounded so scary. I was so scared then. That did not sound good. So we got away. I have no clue where we are. And I'm really scared that we're going to come across some creepy things. So um, basically we've gone out of the layer of where the people that we stole the horse from. Therefore we're safe and we can hit people and attack people with the horse. So that is good and you can do it with the controller. And yeah. And now we're in the snowy layer. Oh no, I do not want to go there because I remember that there are monsters there. <laughs> and they do want to kill you. So let's see if we can go um, away and we'll survive this. Okay, so one thing we do need to find out is how to get off the horse and what button that is. Because that will probably be a big thing that people want to do. So I'm going to try and get off the horse here. I feel like here is a safe area. I can't see anyone here. Ooh. Oh, there we go. So you just have to hold on to X to get off. So I can just steal it again and you can get on. I'm not sure how you actually own a horse as I haven't played the game long enough. But yeah, I'm going to be going to this lovely village here. Look at this. It's so pretty. This is a calm village. All the people are quite nice here. So we're not going to get attacked, luckily. Oh, look. See, we're very safe. 
I'm not sure what happens if you get your horse into water. I'll have to see about that. Well, I'm not here to work, so <laughs> goodbye. Oh my god, oh my god, this is not good. <laughs> and then, ah! Oh, and off we go. I can play this one too. All you, all you need to give me is a horse, and I'm off. I just hope this horse doesn't die on me. I'm just kind of scared because um, around this area I did see giants. Oh my god! <laughs> Help me! I'm gonna go in the water and see what happens. Ooh. So far, it looks like you can go in the water. Oh, okay, they're not reacting. Oh my god, did I kill someone? Oh, I think I hurt a child. Oh no, I think they're after me. Are they after me? I think this is a tense moment. Oh my god, oh! Oh! <laughs> oh my god! This is not a good game. After me again. Okay guys, so the tip for this situation is you can go inside the water. And they will forget what you did to them in 50 years. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes, that is the moral of the story. And do not worry, I have no clue actually what my quest is. So what we do need to do is we need to steal my horse again. <laughs> and off we go, we've just killed an elk and now we found, oh, what's this? Oh, um... <laughs> oh my god! Okay, so we've just killed a novice ice mage. Oh, oh, okay, uh, he's naked now. 